Hello children, today I'm in the bear cave and I look a little bit fluffy because something happened to me. I'll let you have a guess what you think that is. I'm going to read the writing. I'm going to read the title of the story, Goldilocks. Today, I don't know why. Oh dear. Something strange keeps happening to me in this nursery today. Hmm. Once upon a time, there were three bears. There was the great big daddy bear, middle sized mommy bear, and teeny tiny baby bear. They always had porridge for breakfast, but one morning their porridge was much too hot. So the three bears went out for Cooled down. A little girl called Goldilocks was walking through the woods too. When she came to the three bears' cottage, she peeked through the open window and sniffed. Mmm, she said. Porridge! It smells so yummy and it will fill my hungry tummy. Through the window, she climbed. <gasps> And she didn't even ask if she could go in. Goldilocks tiptoed further into the cottage. Oh dear, Mrs. Wilton, something strange is happening to you because you missed a page. Goldilocks first tried Daddy Bear's porridge. Mmm, oh this is just right. So she ate it all up, very greedily. Whew. Goldilocks went further into the house and she spotted three chairs. Oh, after all that porridge, I think I'll have a sit down. First she tried the great big chair and it was so hard she jumped straight off. Teeny tiny chair looked just right, but then she wibbled and she wobbled. Splash! It went all over the floor. Goldilocks was feeling more and more curious, wondering what to do next. What could she find? What could she see? So she went upstairs and she found three beds. She tried them all. First, she tried Daddy Bear's bed. No, too high, she said. The middle-sized bed was far too low, but the teeny tiny bed fell just right. So Goldilocks lay down and fell fast asleep. But just then, the three bears came home. And you'll have to tune in tomorrow.